Hey, good morning everyone. Welcome to Five Acre Homestead. My name is Danny. So quick backstory on this video. So a few years back on our old property here in North Idaho, my parents got Tess and I a carport, a big metal carport, fits three vehicles side by side by side. And uh, before we actually moved to this five acre property with the house on it, uh, we decided to completely disassemble it, tear it down and take it with us. So um, we really need it. So we don't really have a whole, really anywhere to store our vehicles right now for the winter. It's October 18th. The snow, it's coming. It's, it's getting cold at night. It's frosting and we've got some bad weather in the forecast coming up and I don't have a whole lot of time to do this, but um, we have this really cool little place down here, down our little dirt driveway um, where we're currently setting it up. And I wanted to give you guys a sneak peek as to where we're at with the project, but we are in a mad rush to get this done. So we've got the, the basic structure, the bones, of the carport, if you will, already put together. But I did film a little bit of it, and just to give you guys a, a kind of a backstory as to where we began, this corner where the entire carport is, it was a huge dirt mound where the previous owner um, basically stored every bit of trash, every piece of junk, anything that he could really find in. And that big dirt pile turned in to this big dirt pile. I didn't really have a whole lot of places to put it, but we did a lot of tractor work. It was filled with these giant tree roots, concrete, beer bottles, you you name it. And it really just took a, a solid two weeks to really dig through it, level it out, but, uh, but we finally got it. And so we just did a ton of tractor work and, and finally flattened it out, leveled it the best we could. Um, here a few days back, we got a couple loads of gravel delivered and just again, kind of took to the tractor, made sure it was wide enough and just got to work with, uh, with getting the structure set up and it's really coming together. It's looking really, really nice. And my dad's actually on his way, um, to give me a hand this morning and we should ideally get it completed today. Um, the last few days of actually working on it. Um, went pretty well, couple minor bumps, couple, uh, couple hiccups, but we've pretty much got it. And yeah, I'm excited to get this carport up. So, uh, that's what this whole video is going to be on the five acre homestead, getting our carport set up. And I'm excited to have you guys along. Hope you guys all enjoy the video. Be sure to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy it and we'll see you on the build. Thanks for watching. Okay, so yes, we do have a detached garage with all of our junk in it. Um, however, it doesn't fit, it's, it's really small, and my truck won't fit in it, my tractor won't fit in it, and the only vehicle that's really going to fit in it is Tessa's Toyota Prius. So here we're getting our wheelbarrow full of tools. We just gotta take it out and get it down to the carport.
Ready? That's all we're asking for, I guess. All right, the carport is done. Uh, my dad just left and uh, it's about to get dark so we need to start getting everything put away, but what a task. Um, so like I said earlier, the beginning of the video, we took it from our old place, our old house, and it was almost harder to reassemble it because trying to put the carport back up using all the old screw holes just like it was, it was, it was really difficult and trying to get it realigned, re-squared to how it was sitting at our old place just proved to be super difficult and we really kind of struggled with that. So don't look too close, but um, it's up and it's looking pretty darn good. So um, it came in really good time. There is rain in the forecast for the next five days or so, possibly snow, and I've got to get all my rigs just parked under cover, my tractor for one and I'm just tired of everything just kind of being out. And so I'm thrilled to have this thing back and it's gonna be great on the homestead. So I hope you guys enjoyed this build. If you did, be sure to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel and comment down below if you enjoyed it. 
we got to get our things moved in. So before it gets dark, let's get that done. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you on the next video. Thank you.